By the way, you're uh, playing games. My phone just told me. Oh, am I? Yeah. Oh, well, shit. I was supposed to be fucking doing homework. Oh, for all the school that you're in? Yep. I can't wait till my dad graduates college and gets a real fucking job. It just pisses me off how easy his life is right now. Like, my dad worked a factory job for 20-something years, and they, uh... Like, he could have retired from there. But, uh... They shut down the company or whatever. And then he starts, uh... His relationship's all messed up. He went through a midlife crisis. He bought a new car, cashed out his 401k. Now Whoa. he's got nothing, and he's going to school for... To be, um, I think an electrical engineer. And he's almost done. That's quite the change. Yeah. Yeah. He, he got married after knowing the girl for three months. I was impressed. I was like, wow, I didn't think he would actually tie them out. That's like borderline psychotic. Hey, Tony, thank you for that host, man. Much love, dude. Much love, man. Tony. Welsh Tony. You know Tony, man. Tony comes in here every night. Yeah, but I wanted to show love or whatever through the commands, and I don't know his username. Uh, Welsh Tony one. What the hell's the command for that? I have no idea. I don't do that. The mods do that. I never yeah. use that command. Yeah, me either. Um. What is it? Is it Raider? Try that. <laughs> there oh, we go. There it is. I mean, I mean, it kind of works. Shouldn't it bring up his Twitch page? I thought so. Paging LG He's sleeping. Aw. So oh, that's not gonna happen. Not gonna happen. Quick, somebody's screaming wake him up. Yeah, that's that's not gonna happen either. You wanna deal with him when he's pissed off? I mean I guess. He's he's an insufferable cur. Especially if he's trying to sleep. Oh my god, he's difficult to handle at times. I have a phone call right back. <laughs> Alright, so we've made it to 20%. I'm gonna grab a drink, guys. I'll be right back.
what you're getting at here, homie. I mean, I made a couple of changes, but nothing, like, major. Charles, what do you think our total power income is right now? Or power output is? Yo, hey, what up, Crep Shots? Talking, what, 180 times... 18? So we're talking... Roughly thirty-two forty per minute. So thirty-two forty per second, which is 514 minutes equals 8.5 hours of total charge. Yeah, about what I expected. About 3,200. 35, 37. So, four hundred and seventy one minutes, seven point eight hours. Yeah, 7.8 hours till total charge. At our current charge rate, all things going well. I think we have enough fuel for it, to be honest. Once his line backs up and fills up a little more, um, I'm going to go ahead and go back into plastic pellets, and we'll start making even more turbines. While the charge rate is acceptable, we could double it. We could cut it down to three or four hours if, if we go back into plastic pellets, but like I said, we have to... We have to wait until all these fuel lines back up. I need to I need to know that I have a surplus of fuel before I start doing that. Two, by the way, have already backed up. So at this point, I'm just waiting on this third line. To make this go a little bit faster, I'm going to take this out. Um, and just put it like this. And then we'll put the turbine back in. Uh, Drago, the OET charges the spaceship.
which has come into lower orbit since we've started charging the OET. There are going to be a lot of new features coming. Yo, what's up, Crab Shots? Uh, me? Uh, well, I'm spending my Valentine's Day with all of you lovely people. Which is exactly where I should be. I think this is a perfect ending to a perfect day. Wish I had a little whiskey, though. To be honest. I'd settle for rum. But on Valentine's Day, you're supposed to get, like, obsessively depressed about being single for a long time, right? I think that's what you're supposed to do. I don't know, I never do it, but I'm pretty sure that's what's supposed to happen, so... Oh, no, I mean, absolutely, we could, Tony, we could go nuts with this, but we don't need to. We don't need to, and that's kind of the point. Okay, so that's all done, so now I need to hook the turntable back up. Wasn't a turntable. Shit. Was the wrong thing. That's what I want there. Okay. So, pretty soon these are all gonna back up. Because this guy over here. Wait, why did this one empty out so damn fast? What changed over here? What have you done? Charles changed something. I don't know what he changed. I don't know, Tony. I have no idea what happens at the end. I have no earthly idea. Yeah, that happens from time to time, where the, the actual original outputting turbines will run out of fuel, uh, because the fuel line runs through them. Uh, so you have to come over here and stick all the fuel in here, that way that whole system will just continue to cycle properly. Um, how are we doing on the empty canisters? I think we're pretty good on them, to be honest. Oh yeah, we are definitely good on the empty canisters. So we're going to have to let this run for probably about another 10 or 15 minutes or so before it's, you know, completely just filled up all the lines, uh, including itself. You know, we want that, we want, we want the, 
actual hopper that's sitting next to the turbines to be full. And that means everything in the line is full. And then we'll switch back over to plastic pellets, completely dedicate the biomass to plastic pellets, and then we'll make more turbines, and then we'll turn it back on again. But as of right now, it looks like everything has pretty good power, so... Except, I don't know why this laser is turned off. This... Why is that laser turned off? Seems a bit silly. That wasn't actually outputting any fuel. Neither of these were. There we go. Alright. Now we're running on all cylinders again. And that looks like it's backed up. So pretty soon this whole line's gonna back up. And it'll back up all the way to the original hopper and then down the line. So it's looking pretty good right now. With the charge time, um, we're doing, yeah, like what is the percentage per second? I haven't actually worked out the percentage per second. Um, it's not really important. All that I really care about is how long is it going to take us to complete the actual charge. And I think we said it was something like seven or eight hours for full charge. But that's from zero percent. We're already at 20, right? So that's a bump in the proper direction there. And we're not going to stop here. We're going to add more turbines. Um, these actual uh, Mark III lasers that we have here, they're capable of um, taking power from I think it's like four turbines, maybe even up to six turbines um, and out per output. So we've got plenty of space for growth here. Like I said, we're just waiting for the fuel to back up before we do any do the next step, uh, which is actually basically based on that hopper right there. Because when that hopper fills up, things will back up. As a gamer who wears full-time headphones, always keep a box of Q-tips next to you. How much nickel have I got? Right, there's there's a hundred. Hundred in the chest, man. I kept about fifty on me. I mean, in all technicality, we do have another four turbines. Once we have enough fuel, we don't really need the turbines running and digging and doing anything anymore. We could just pull the other turbines up and stick them all right here. It's an idea. I don't like that idea because I like the I, I don't like the idea of cutting off my production ever. Add solar to it. Solar's not really worth it, Drago. Um, the only solar that's really worth it is the uh, tier three solar. Uh, which we don't have the research unlocked for it, so we're we're actually just doing the charge before we get to that point. We don't need to get to that point. Uh, and to be honest, I I can't wait to get the fuck off of Greg mode. You're telling me, but I don't even play as much as you do, and it sucks. Do we do this on like scarce or rush mode? And you're just gonna flip the fuck out. Like rush mode is like one to one to two, like bar ratio. Dude, fuck that. Like, scarce mode is 8 to 1. 
That's the hard mode, by the way. Can you imagine eight to one? We'd be f we'd be swimming in resources. Remember, guys, don't spend all your resources because at some point we may need to um, go back down and uh, hook up another biomass line if this takes too long and we actually run that biomass line dry, which at our current rate is very potentially going to happen. Well, worst comes to worst, so we can hook up some coal to it. If it's like two or three percent or some shit like that. Some kind of stupid little amount. I'm totally I'm totally down doing like a hundred PTGs or something. Yeah, the tier three solars, the ones that sit on top of the uh, the Mark IV battery. Right? It's the it's like it just it's a big fucking panel. The, it, I don't actually think it's called Tier 3, though. It's called something else, but it's definitely, technologically, that's Mark II Solar. Mark II Solar, my ass. You know how much those generate? Bullshit, that's Mark II. It may be labeled Mark II, but it ain't Mark II. It's Mark III or Mark IV. You label it whatever the fuck you want, but, I mean, the numbers of the actual power generation on that thing, it's like 100 and... 20 power per second, right? That's almost as good as a turbine, okay? And if you're going to tell me that turbines are fucking Mark II, no. No, turbines are not Tier 2 technology. They're Tier 3 technology. 162 PP PPS in your case. Yeah, that's not Tier 2 technology. Tier 2 technology would be somewhere in the range of, you know, like 10 to 20 PPS. Uh, that shit's, like, fucking way above that. I still think it, it should have been called Mark III Solar. Like, personally, I think a solar panel would be Mark I. Organic solar would be part Mark II. And the organic solars, by the way, those actually capture power at night. Which would be nice if we had more pristine heavy shitlin. Chitin. Uh, it's it's pronounced Shitlin, bud. I worship butt plugs for a living. It's Shitlin. Are you sure about that? That's how I would pronounce that as Shitlin. CH sound makes a shit in that context. For but there's me. no there's no L in it. You're saying it like Shitlin. Like there's oh, an L in there. I there's no, see that. It's, it's I thought there chitin. was an L in there. Oh. I call it shitting then. Right. No, it's it's chitting. Chitting. Ch sound makes a makes a sh sound for me. Yes, it does. It's, for no, me, no, no, it's, where it's I'm from, it's a ch sound. Where I'm from, it's not it's a shitting. It's it's shit. It's it's chitting. It's shitting. Whatever. I'm telling you, bud. It's just an accent type. You, you know what? I, I nearly I nearly took you serious until I realized you're fucking stupid. <laughs> no, that's it's an accent thing, dude. That's really how I would say it. That's then that's your accent. That, that's what I said. It's an accent thing. But, but no, you corrected me like, bud. You're totally saying that wrong. And I was if thinking you were myself, from where I'm from, you were saying it the wrong. Fuck. So I don't. I don't know. Where you don't you even want to know how they fucking pronounce it where I'm from. Probably be more like shiting. Charles. <laughs> Charles. Pretty sure it's chitin. Chitin. It. You know. We're just gonna call it the the fucking kitten from now on because <laughs> the fucking how tranqui tra tranquilas they're fucking pronounces the kitten, it. The fucking kitten. Yeah, you guys got any, got any hardened kitten? Tranquil. Tran tran tranquiliza. The fight. We we need more of the heavy kitten. We need, more, we need more of the fucking the the heavy the heavy kitten. 
the heavy armored kitten. The pristine, pristine, uh, heavy, pristine heavy kitten and the pristine light kitten is what yep. we're what we're missing here. Yep, all the kitten. God damn it! Why won't you fill, you son of a bitch? Ah, oh, it's taking forever. This bitch is gonna be charged by the time I get back to making turbines. I mean, two of the lines are completely full, and then there's this fucker. This fucking one douchebag. Making fun of my my name. My I don't Spanish hate name. Spanish people. I just hate him. It has it has nothing to do with because he's Spanish. Spanish. It has nothing to do with the fact that he's Spanish. It has to do with the fact that his name spells sp sp is spelled like fucking tequila. Te Tranquila. Sounds more like a black girl's name than anything. And that is a hate crime, bud. That CMD to had going down was 28 earlier. It was 47. The seemed... Oh, that seemed to had going down... Drago, you better be Russian or autistic. <laughs> it's, it's Drago, Doctor Drago. <laughs> don't, you, don't you know who Drago is, man? He's he's the fucking Russian from uh, Rocky. <laughs> Ivan Drago. Dude, stereotypes are in place because they're real. They are. Yeah, like uh. What was what was that joke? I think fucking... all my cousins are very attractive. Thank you yeah, very so, much. So this is this. I'm going to tell a joke. It no longer. It, it does not represent any of my personal feelings or emotions. It is simply repeating a joke from Tosh that I thought was chuckle worthy. I love what's, disclaimers. What's the difference between uh, a black man in an unemployment line and a pizza? What? Pizza can feed a family of five. Nice. Nice. A single pizza? Family of five. Are they fucking anorexic? I don't know. Maybe they're fucking Ethiopians, man. <laughs> That's racist. A large <laughs> pizza, I'd normally say, feeds... That's black. About two adults. That's gay. That's racist. You ever seen that one? Um, no. Uh, Hula, I'm pretty sure you have to donate five bucks for the message to be displayed on stream. You can try again, though. No, 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 no. Well, I, I mean, I get, I get donation messages, don't I? Uh, I'm pretty sure you changed it to five bucks and above. For you message. know what? You know what? You know what happened? He doesn't huh? realize there's a delay. He doesn't realize there's a delay. And there's, it's, it's a, it's a, it's a Twitch Messenger fucking thing, dude. Just not give that it, much of a delay. Give it a second, and uh, well, the delay can be up to five minutes, right? Oh, from, from the money to clear. Yeah, from what I've seen, right? I never have more than thirty seconds, but then again, Wells Fargo doesn't really care what you spend your money on. I'm waiting for it, cause I I see it, I see it, and I'm just waiting for it. You know what? Come to think of it, when's the last time somebody clicked follow and I could actually see it? I haven't seen a single follow today. No. Maybe hey, I haven't Hula. received any follows. I have received follows today. If you donate five more dollars, you can you can uh, no, 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 play, no, no, play no, Minecraft no. with this us. This is this is just something's f fucked up Fucky. here, man. Yeah. What the fuck is up with that? Nice outfit, Charles. Real pink. I only donate if it's either Twitch alerts or directly through PayPal. I don't trust those third-party sites. I barely trusted Twitch alerts because my my PayPal is linked directly to my bank account. Fucking, okay, I'm sorry, Hula. So, Hula donated ten dollars with the message for batteries to refuel all the butt plugs. True. Well, thank you, you for your donation, the, Hula. You gotta power the Bluetooth butt plug somehow. 
Did, oh, you know, we haven't shown that to people. By the way, oh I, posted, I posted a link in chat. Um, let, me, let me post it again, so... And I'll throw it over on Skype so you can get it. I actually haven't seen this clip. I've only seen the meme for it, so... I'm gonna just play it real quick. Oh, uh, have you got that link that I sent? Oh, you know what? It's it's probably still in here, isn't it? It should be. Is it in last night's call? Where the fuck is it? Here it is. I just hope this thing doesn't open up like a fucking... <laughs> so, so here you guys go. I love I love how the fucking copyright is glowfuckyourself.com. <clears throat> Dude, th did you actually look at the rest of that though? Like they have a whole product line of just weird shit on Etsy of butt plugs. What is this? This is four minutes long. Oh, the first clip is pretty funny. Okay, all right. I'll watch, guy. watch the first watch clip. It later. Hold on. Watch oh, watch it later. It later? Okay. It's all not right. important. It just it's along the lines of the oh that's racist. That's black. That's homophobic. Whatever. Okay. You know, I got a lot of follows today, and like not one single fucking pop up. I like, I like the fucking wall. Who put that up? You know, I think we could actually. I think you can actually block off the flame. I've never tried it, but I'm willing to bet you could probably do it. Your OCD would probably fucking flare up. Charles, did you just build that? You could at least center the text. Oh, you nope. did. Hold on, hold on. It goes right through the fucking wall. Never mind. Okay, so blocking off flame does nothing. Wait, wait. Did, did you actually try to stand it to see if it did nothing? Could just be a visual thing. Yeah, yeah, that's not gonna happen. I'll do it. I'm not rebuilding that. I'll, re I'll rebuild it, don't worry. Yeah, give, give, give that a shot. See what happens. See if you burn to death. Oh, nope. It sure doesn't. What? Jet turbines are dangerous. Jet turbines are dangerous. <laughs> <laughs> uh, who would have thunk it? Jet turbines. <laughs> Aren't you supposed to be attacked big time when you charge the OET? Uh, yes, you are. Unless you turn what? off off the fight. Um... You, you are, in fact, supposed to be attacked, like, big time. However, uh, we have a very... We have a... We have a very big problem with our world, uh, which has caused us no amount of grief and strife, uh, which is the multiplayer, when set on default settings, number one puts you in Greg mode, and then number two sticks you in tutorial mode permanently. So we have had no mobs the entire game. I don't know if you know this, but there are a lot of recipes that are dependent on having mobs in this game. A lot of them. A lot of very important ones. Especially if you're playing Greg mode, like coal enrichers. So... Yeah, we, it took us forever to get one of those. So we were on basic coal for like days. Like we had to go around blowing up hives. And when you have no lithium, and you have no batteries, you have no nothing, 
it becomes very, what would we spend like fucking two days just trying to get enough lithium to make the bombs god what a fucking nightmare that was So, this is our our payback from Greg Mode. They have handed us this gift and said, seeing as how we made your lives such fucking utter shit for the last week, here you go. Here's one for you. Thank you, Greg Mode. Thank you. And other than this, fuck, fuck you. Yeah, but here's the thing, dude. If we had, like, five of them coming out of the back of every single one of our coal lines, and every single thing was being powered off of enriched coal, think how much more power we'd make on everything. Double. We wouldn't have had to... Double. Yeah, double. We wouldn't have had to spend half as many resources. We would have exponentially grown considerably faster. Imagine the research... All the research we spent fucking just dumping handfuls of coal into the research assemblers. Oh no! Oh no! We do get Minox. In fact, Minox are the only fucking thing we do get in this game. That's it. Just fucking Minox. Yeah. Go fuck yourself, right? Go fuck yourself. Dragmode's a dick. It's like, it's like, by the way, we're going to take all the mobs from you, but then we're going to give you Minox. Okay, great. And by the way, the Minox don't drop any of the useful shit. Feed hives. Listen to me, Trank. You can't build the fucking bomb. You can't build the bomb. It's too expensive. And by the time you can build it, it's not worth it. You know? Do, do you want to go hunt down 15 different hives to get all the things that you need for those 20 or 30 coal enrichers? No. Nobody does. You know why? Because it's fucking stupid. This whole game mode since we started was just one brick wall after another after another where we had to get very, very creative in order to circumvent that. And I tell you what, Charles... And Brandon here have been a big, big help. And Noor, too. Uh, I don't know where the fuck he's flittered off to the last couple of days, but... Like, we had to go down and super dig. We, we super dug out a fucking million tin line by hand because we needed the tin. Do you have but any lenses? I do. Can I have? Yeah, what do you use them for? Uh, to increase the laser line from the whatever line you have shooting over here. Wait, what? To increase the power over this. It's uh, caught up over there where there's a level one thing. Oh god, I don't even give a shit about that thing. Uh, it's still going to be bringing in like 300 more power per second. Right now it's producing 10. Why don't we just put these as Mark III lasers? I can afford them. Because I don't have Mark III lasers. I, I can, I'll build you some. Hold on. No leave it, he says. Never mind. No leave it, he says. I've actually got a Mark III laser on me. But you're gonna kill the other things it's powering. Yeah. Yeah. I, I agree with him. Like, just for whatever... In, who gives a shit? We're gonna be... I mean, like, I think we're pretty much done with this game. You know, we're literally just waiting out the last bits of charging the OET. You know. Is that fuel line backed up yet? Please, please start backing up. That way I can fucking be done with this. Come, what the fuck, man? It's like, it's like trying to, it's like escapades here, man. Oh, we are so close to this line backing up. So fucking incredibly close. Yes, she blows.
And that side is like sucking down the power. Maybe the OET is Craig's butt plug. I was thinking more like DJs, but whatever. I don't think that's going to fit in Arcus's asshole. What do you think he's got a tight little one? Yeah. We'll have to ask him. I'm, uh, I'll, I'll let you handle that. And don't you start that sentence with Worm wants to know. <laughs> Worm wants to know if you're the OPT will fit in your butthole. No, Worm wants to know if you have a tight little asshole. <laughs> Wait, what? You gonna yank your damn key, boy. <sighs> well, thank you for that donation, dude. That's really cool of you, bro. I'm sorry Any, the message anytime. didn't pop up. That's just Twitch alerts, dude, being fucking stupid. I don't know why Twitch alerts does this shit to me. I was wondering oh. why I wasn't getting any follower notifications today. I was like, dude, not a single person has followed me today. It's fucking weird. Good news. Got my tax return. Oh, wow, nice. You buying a new computer? No, I'm... I'm I think I'm just going to get a decent tablet. Okay. Because... The tablets nowadays have the fucking flip-up keyboards. You know? Why don't you go for, like, a Surface Pro or something? They're incredibly I expensive. I don't know. What that, I don't want incredibly expensive. I just want a decent one. They're cool because they're tablets and they're laptops. You need to stop taking fuel. Son of a bitch. Dude. It's like every time I think this line's gonna back up, it, it takes one. But it's only that line. That's the fucking weird part. Like, the other lines don't move nearly as much as that one does. Jesus. A Surface Pro, 128 gigabytes. Is fucking eight hundred and ninety-four dollars off Amazon. Yeah, dude, they're incredibly expensive. They're they're stupid expensive, but they're cool because you can actually unhook the bottom and use it as a tablet. And then when you get back, you can plug it back in. They've got a processor in each, and they work in conjunction with each other. So when you fucking snap it back in, you're back to gaming power. Oh my god, eight gigabytes of RAM, two hundred fifty-six gigabytes of storage is one thousand one hundred ninety-nine dollars. I could build a computer better than that for that much fucking. Oh yeah, yeah. They're stupid. They're rich guy toys. I got a buddy of mine who bought one. I got to play around with it. I thought it was very cool. I thought the price of it was so fucking expensive that he was a moron. Do you know if they have expandable memory? Like SD cards? I don't know. Yeah, rich guy toy. Sorry, I was wiping off. What the fuck, Icarus? I don't know what that means, but I like it. I, I don't know what it means either. I, I'm kind of I'm kind of okay with it. Well, I, I'm not broke by any means, Hula. I'm just glad to have my refund. I have no outstanding bills. I have no debt at anything, so it's. All right, we're gonna we're gonna turn this back over to pellets for a little while, uh, which means we actually have to shut this line off right here. Oh, wait a minute. I don't... Th Never mind. I'm wrong. I can't do that just yet. I gotta wait until that guy... I gotta wait until those two are full up before I do that. Because otherwise those two will actually run out of power. Alright. So I'll just need to get a... Uh... But that looks pretty good. Oh, yeah, okay. I'll just need to get an SD card adapter, a micro SD adapter to SD. I mean, dude, don't actually buy a Surface Pro, dude. They're a fucking waste of money. I found a Surface 2. Dude, I just want something. Dude, uh, if you want a... What dude, kind of dude, tablet should I get? Dude, fucking, like, just get a tablet, man. I mean, don't get one of those. The Google tablet. Here it is. Ooh.
What's a decent size for a tablet, would you say? Like... Ooh, very nice. I'm not an I'm not an Apple supporter. I don't support what I don't support what, what they do. What do you mean, like not an Apple supporter? You don't have to be an Apple jockstrap man. You just have to fucking enjoy I, the tablets, dude. I don't like their products. I don't like the way that they require emails for everything, and how that you have to have the currency from them and blah blah blah. Okay. I just I, I don't like the whole the whole way it's set up, and I don't like Apple. They have the best gear, but I'll definitely go second best before I buy Apple. I'm using a closed water cooler for my CPU, and it works glorious. Got a Nexus 7 next to me, I use it some. Yeah, the Nexus tablets are pretty good. I would probably go with a Nexus tablet. I would go with any Android-based tablet. Um, you know what I ha I used to have was the LG G Pad. They're like fucking 50 bucks right now. And it's just a tablet. It doesn't have to be great. They're not like super powerful, but I could watch movies on it. And I, I thought it was great. You know. Uh, I don't know if they, they made a new... Uh, I don't know if they made a new one, though. Oh uh, yeah, like, they they upgraded from the Nexus Seven. It's up to a Nexus Nine. Right? Oh, they do have an LG Pad too. Oh, fucking kick ass! I'm gonna buy one of these. Send me the link. You um, get matching ones, and but let me Google that for you. Stickers on them. <laughs> Hold on, I don't I don't know if this is a good price for this. Okay, this is just the first link I clicked, right? Probably like way too fucking expensive for that. So oh, I'll compare around real quick while you're streaming. LG G Pad Two. Yeah, let's see, they've got the. I only see the one the one company selling it. Why is that? What the fuck? LG Pad Two, ten inch. It's a 10.1 inch. I like I like the smaller ones. I'd probably get the 8 inch. 8 inch? Yeah. Uh, the 8 inch one's 160 on Amazon. See, that's not bad. That's not bad at all. I could buy. I could still buy a laptop with that. Hmm. Yeah, I would. I would get that. And by the way, they can tie right into your fucking cell phone plan if you have a certain carrier. I don't plan on doing that. Okay, I just, I find it very useful to have them, um, you know, because then you can use the GPS when you're driving and shit like that. Um, and i tell you what, they make a fucking beautiful, big-ass GPS screen. Although, usually, to be honest, I usually just put it in the car seat next to me and, turn left here. Oh, okay. You know. Galaxy Note? That's a huge difference, Drago. It's like you went from you went from the the smallest screen to the largest screen possible. It's like two huge differences. Hey, what's up, Bob? How are you doing today, buddy? Yeah, now that I'm looking at these. LG G Pad 2s. Because I had the original G LG G Pad and I fucking loved that thing. Absolutely loved that thing. Um, it was a bit slow as far as processing power was concerned, but. The, um, ah, you know, for the price, I couldn't bitch at all. Because I got it. I got it for free. When I bought my cell phone, they were like, hey, do you want a tablet? It's an extra 10 bucks a month. I was like, uh, yeah. Uh -huh. And they were like, so we've got these Nexus tablets and so on and so forth. Those run about 20 bucks a month. And I was like, wait a minute, I have an LG phone. There's a LG tablet right here. It's like, oh yeah, it uses the same process and everything. It's just just like your phone, just a bigger screen. And like the the fucking processor in the LG phone is like OP as fuck. So I was like, well, 
that makes perfect sense. And I grab one of those up. Man, that was a great idea. Because of the stylus. I agree uh, around that, Icarus. Kit Kat does have some serious fucking memory leaks. Really, Apple is idiot-proof. Android gives you a lot more access to things. Apple really is idiot-proof. No, it's not. Uh, personally, what I've seen, my grandmother uses an iPhone and does it fine. Oh, if I gave her an Android, she'd fucking lose her shit. No, no, I totally agree about that. But, I mean, there's a big difference between idiot-proof and well, my grandmother idiot. who doesn't know how to get into, like, doesn't know how to fucking break stuff. Like... I, I can't tell you how many stability issues I've had with apps from the App Store. The App Store apps are quite often... Oh, shit. Battle. Emperor! Sorry. We come for you! Like, now, just try taking a picture on an Android and compare that to an iPhone. Like... Um, here's here's an example of taking a picture, right? See my phone has this right on the front, right? And you can actually swipe it to pick an app. So if I just want a camera app, I just go camera, right? If I click it there. Did I, did I get it? There we go. And now I can take a photo just by tapping the screen. Ah! Okay. So that's that's pretty cool. And then just not not don't take another photo. Go back. Go back right that's that's awesome right so it's a magnetic cover that has two separate interfaces and i can actually i can actually double click the button on the back just to take a photo anytime i want so just holding the phone click click boom camera it's always got the camera app loaded on the phone which hey Chris, what kind of what kind of androids are you talking about dude because i have an s6 and it does not take seconds to take a, a photo iPhone is tenths of a second at most. I, I've never had issues with taking pictures on my Android. Well, I mean, listen to me. All all phones are going to take time to take a photo. You know, simply from, you know, I mean, it depends on whether you're doing flash or not flash or, you know, well, shit, I lost all my damn points. <laughs> oh, hold on. So, phone on camera mode, right? That that photo took probably about three seconds ago, right? So, I'll try this again just so you can see. Photo taken. It's not a tenth of a second. It's probably about a second or so, but it's pretty damn fast. And apparently I need to dust. <laughs> it's funny too, because it doesn't have chroma key on it. And mind you, that's not a new phone by any means. Yay, I can actually chat. Welcome welcome back, Tony. Did Tony get fucking timed out for something? Did I not notice him get timed? I, I must not have noticed. I'm sorry, Tony. You probably deserved it anyway. <laughs> what'd you do? Richard, what'd you do? What? X4 Honor. A, a what? I've never even I've never even heard of that. Oh, 
I tell you what I'm I'm looking forward to is that LG G5. That won't be ready for another like four years. I tell you what, the S7, the G4 is a fucking wonderful phone. Oh, that's uh, that's because of Billy. Um, yeah, we have a we have a we have a, a kid that comes in here, Billy. He, I, I haven't actually seen him in weeks. I'm starting to wonder where the fuck he if he's ever coming back or not. He he moved, and since he moved, he hasn't come back online. I'm gonna message him actually. I'm gonna do that real quick. Just throw him a message real quick. So a buddy of mine, buddy of mine posts up this image that says, you know, a little 4th of July joke. It says the best way through a man's heart or the best way to a man's heart is through the 4th and 5th ribs. And uh, I responded to his image with, or buy him an anvil. Men fucking love anvils. Dude, I wish I had the patience to do blacksmithing. It is so fucking cool. It is very cool. But you see what I'm saying? It's just, it's one of those gifts that nobody goes, oh, thanks. You know, it's one of those, you're like, that's the coolest thing anybody's ever gotten. I don't know if I'll ever use that anvil, but that's the coolest thing anybody's ever given me. I'm going to sneeze. Okay. Hey. All right. Oh, I got the new button in time. I think that's cool as fuck, Icarus. All right, so... That's all pretty much full. Which means those are both half full on the top there. Which means I gotta start turning the fuel line back on. <sighs> I guess the only thing I can really think of is just turn one of these fuckers that way. And just start making the pellets just a little bit at a time while still producing fuel. Yo, what's up, Benson? Looks like we're just about hitting 30%. What the fuck is this? Oh, he's filling up that one automatically from now on. Oh, and he's prepping. Oh, Charles has actually been building fucking more turbines while I haven't been paying attention. Do I usually have any biomass on me? It's a fanta- I do, I do have biomass on me. Why don't we just fucking feed that in there? Let's let a couple of those run out of there.
Is do you think it's generally going to be cheaper to buy a tablet online than it will be to go to like a store like? Um, well, okay, it really depends. Like, you have if you're if you're going to bundle the tablet with a cell phone, it'll no, be considerably it, it, no. cheaper. I no, I already have a split plan with my father and my uncle. I don't want to raise their bill anymore. No, 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 no. When I'm oh, okay, all right. Um. Then I think online are probably your best bet. Oh, that's probably fine. I think that's fine. That's fine. Oh, congratulations, Benson made regular. And as long as he reminds me of that, I'll go ahead and add him as a regular. It doesn't do it automatically, Benson. I actually have to add you. But you're added now. Uh, I'll add you too, Trank. Give me a second here. There you go. You're added. Anybody else in here that is a regular that I haven't added yet? Uh, if you're added to regulars, Icarus, you can post links in chat. I did, but I have to add you manually. <laughs> Be sure if you step in my circle, you can handle a multiple blunt scenario. Uh, Tony, how many how many hours have you got? Fifty nine hours. Enough, boy. There you go. You're added now, Tony. Yo, what's up, Billy? How are you today, buddy? Alright, 
don't know if you guys know this, but you'll keep moving if you hit the escape key right after you hit the ground. And it'll it'll hold your speed, so if you're you're going kind of fast, it's actually kind of a way of sliding across things. It's like a little auto run. <laughs> oh, we'll get it, Benson. We'll get it. Icarus, is there like a hidden fucking thing in your name? Did I misspell it? Because it didn't actually pop up as adding a regular when I put it in there. Well, let me try and re-add you, man. You're you're added, dude. I don't know why the fuck the bot doesn't like you, but whatever. Hey Chris, you're unbanned. Snipers, you get you get used to it. I got about a, I got about a sixty gig SSD. Actually, I have two of them in RAID Zero. They're tied together for like 110, but it's still not not enough fucking space. No, Icarus, Icarus, do it, do it again, man. I'll unban you again, but give it another shot. I gotta gotta figure out why that's not working. I actually copied and pasted your name directly into regular, so I have no idea why it didn't why it didn't take. Yeah. <laughs> Fucking what the fuck, man. Oh, that's coming from Spice Spot. That's why. It's coming from Spice Spot. Okay. Yeah, actually, the only one that can add you guys is Devin. He's the only one who's got access to the spice bot for regulars so i can add you so the moo bot doesn't ban you but i can't add you so that spice bot doesn't ban you so yeah that's just kind of how that's gonna go oh charles took all the plastic pellets I, I guess he's probably making more turbines oh he is indeed Uh, but we haven't turned the fuel back on because we're making pellets. Well, that makes sense. Yeah, Icarus, it, you know, this is one of the reasons, like I said, why we're trying to make our own bot, because it's such a pain in the ass. I'm going to let some of these, uh, some of this fuel run out of this one here. Alright, I bought the tablet. Tell me how it is, because if, if it's good, I'll make it my next donation goal. Although, I probably have better donation goals I could probably go for. Divorce. You know. Butt plugs. Butt plugs. Yeah. Actually, what I'd like to do is raise about 80 bucks for that fucking software that allows me to use the knobs on this thing to adjust my volumes. That would be pretty cool. And then I think I want a label maker after that so I can label everything on here with some kind of labels. <laughs> I'm not the mood. Not in the mood. I'm not the mood. Not in the mood. Mood's a thing for cattle and love play, not fighting. Worm, did you try multi streaming? Yes, I did, Benson. Um, it didn't accept Fortress Craft as a game when I did Joystream. So, 
it didn't look like I was online on Twitch. So none of my viewers knew I was online, which really kind of sucked ass. So I don't think I'll be doing that again anytime soon. Uh, Trank, they already have apps. They have tons of soundboard apps, but they're just not as cool as the having actual soundboard. the actual soundboard. Yeah. I mean, that's pretty important in my opinion. I like how we turned both of these, like, this direction. It's not, it's not that big a deal, to be honest. It's fine. Um... Where's the Mark III laser? Well, he's doing that. I'm going to make the lasers and get those ready. I need more nickel. That looks like I'm going down to the nickel line. Uh, no, Welsh. Uh, Tony, this is, this is not an actual physical soundboard. It's something different. I bought the Akai MPD 280. It's uh, it's a drum pad, right? It's for finger drumming, um, and I'm using it as a soundboard. I've got it loaded full of soundboard clips, so I'll show it to you. Looks like this, right? And I can I can kill with a word. That's a button and do a sound on it. It is by will alone I set my mind in motion. It is by the juice of sapu that thoughts acquire speed, the lips acquire stains, the stains become a warning. It is by will alone I set my mind in motion. My worst nightmare involved a pack of rabid wolves. I was stuck somewhere in the Yukon, and there were tall, skinny you ever, rabbits. Have you ever done actual thing And they were drinking it? heavily. No. Oh. Okay, so here's the thing. It has all these uh, knobs on it, right? And these knobs can be uh, changed uh, because they're all MIDI output knobs. So what I need is I need a MIDI interpreting software that um, will interpret these and then allow me to tie them to the Windows mixer. Okay, and that last part is the key part. That's the hard. An entire that's species. the hard part, right? So only one software out there actually will do that, as far as I know. Um, and therefore, I have to get special software because I'm trying to make it do something that it's not designed for, right? It is basically an Ovation Launchpad. Exactly right. Right. That's exactly correct. Um, we need steel. Okay. Um, well, I've got a ton of iron, dude. You know, I've, I'm sitting on 900 iron. So if you need steel, I'll make you a bunch of fucking steel. You took the turbine parts. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to take the turbine parts. Hold, hold on, dude. Give me just a second. I'm coming right back over there in just a second. I'm just trying to make uh, a laser transmitter. There, that's what that's what that's what I had on me, dude. Does this actually work in this spot? It looks like it does. Okay, so is that going to work there? That should be just fine.
Uh, actually, you can, Trank. You absolutely 100% can. Um, I have Ableton Live. I don't use it um, because the Ableton Live doesn't work very well with this pad because I have to go through so many extra steps to take clips and modify clips and so on and so forth like you would do in a professional sound studio. Um, the MPC software that they provide is very good, but I need... I need an interpreter to go from the MPC software to inter... I'll just... I'll link you guys what I'm talking about here. This... this is the program I need. And I want to say it's like 65 bucks USD. Right? Um... Sixty-seven dollars, plus a conversion fee, right? So it's like 70, 75 bucks. So, yeah, it takes it takes a little bit of effort, right? Uh, and it's got really good stuff, and it's one of the few that I've been told will work with the Windows Mixer. Right, a lot of a lot of the MIDI software out there is not designed to work with Windows mixers at all. Because let's face it, if you're doing MIDI stuff, you probably don't give a fuck about interpreting signals from Windows Mixer and then sending them back to Windows. It's a pain in the ass. But this software will do that. So I can use this MPD in conjunction with the MPC software and the Bohm software to allow me to adjust all of my volumes via the mixing knobs on it. Which would mean I would never again have to go actually into my mixer on the computer again. I'll hard mount this kind of up, up high somewhere, you know, and if I need to adjust it, I can just press a button. So it'll be like floating over on my left hand side of my desk, you know, um, uh, on a on an actual like stand that I'll build for it out of wood, you know, uh, I just need like a 45 degree angle cut or a 30 degree angle cut with you know a little lip on the bottom to stick it on, right? And then I can do all my adjustments from there, and it'll fit right nicely, and neatly on my desk under my monitors, uh, which is the reason why we're building the new desk, which is the whole point. Okay, is that I don't have enough space in this room or on this desk to properly accommodate everything that I have. And right around that same time, hopefully, that we start building the, the new desk, we should be ordering the new chair uh, and getting this ratty, fucking radly piece of shit out of here. Um, Can we have a d destruction video? I'm not going to tear this chair apart. I'm just going to... I'm going to disassemble it and throw it in the fucking trash can. Uh -huh. Or I'll put it on the curb and see if somebody wants it. I mean... It's not in terrible shape, you know. I mean, I have reupholstered it. The The cloth is actually in fairly clean condition. I think most people will take a look at this chair and go, wait a minute, that's in fairly good condition. The only thing that's wrong with it is I haven't reupholstered the back, and the back's a bit ratty, you know. I, I could make a slip cover for it in, like, fucking ten minutes. Slip covers are easy as fuck. <clears throat> then we can praise the new chair, that's right. And if uh, Dork ever gives me the correct information, what I'll do is I'll send the pillow off, because the DX Racers come with a pillow, and his mother runs, like, an embroidery... She's got, like, one of those nice embroidery companies, right? And I'll send her the pillow and see if she'll do a design for my name on the pillow. It'd be really cool to have a fucking chair with my name on it. Yeah? Yeah? Cool? I think it'd be cool. Get a little worm on it or something? Yeah. I can't wait to get that fucking chair, dude. I'm like super hyped up. Uh, you know, this whole time Charles has probably been yelling at me, Dude, give me the fucking iron. And I just like haven't even been paying attention. Um, I should probably help him with making these jet turbines. You took the turbine parts. You took the turbine parts.
I'm not gonna be able to stay up for you guys to charge this. So, have fun. Is that one not getting fuel? I don't think we're producing the fuel fast enough. Um, oh, you know what we did? We, we That's right, we cut off the fuel because um, we weren't bringing the biomass in. Alright, so it's making fuel again. Nope, but not for a smoke. That would be fucking... How sweet would that be, dude? A fucking Mr. Worm Chair? That'd be awesome. I'd be ecstatic. Giddy like a little girl. But I'll, I'll tell you what I'm most excited about is just getting the new desk because um, it, it's desperately needed. Internet hasn't dropped yet, by the way. What's that? Internet hasn't dropped. I noticed. Actually, I didn't notice, but it's, that's good. 34 Did he already make the turbine housings for the other two? He didn't. Okay, so I need to make those. Which means low grade steel bar, which we have no nickel. So nickel's actually the thing that's holding us up right now for making more turbines. More turbines. making shit for nickel. Oh, no wonder. Ah, oh, damn it. Well, there goes that. The, uh, the f fucking other nickel line has run out. This is this is gonna come off. I'm too fucking here. I'm starting to fucking sweat in this bitch. Should I get some drumsticks? Um, like the ice cream ones? No, like actual drumsticks. For what? Why not? Why? Are you, why do people ask that question, dude? Do you like drumming? I don't know. I mean, it can. I mean, what's the worst that could happen? You waste your money. How is it a waste, though? 
I mean, you asked what's the worst that could happen, and that's the worst thing I could think of is just a waste of money. You know. Oh, those look like very comfortable headphones. What? I I'm looking at them. What, what headphones? Uh, Burr Hringer. I don't even know what the fuck that even means. Baron Behringer or Baradine? Hey, it's probably Behringer. That's the wrong video. Hold on. That's not what I wanted. That's what I wanted. Yeah. Behringer HPS 3000s. Those are comfortable. Dude, if you're if you're buying new headphones, spend a hundred bucks. Make yourself make yourself happy, man. I've never spent more than fifty bucks on headphones, and I'm very happy. Well, I mean, at least get like a fucking I don't know. You know, I'm I'm a I'm a headphone whore, so my headphones now just so get hot. So they get hot. They don't breathe at all. Holy shit! Like that one song gets like super loud compared to all the rest of my fucking songs. So what would you recommend for headphones then? If you don't want your head to get hot? Yeah. Uh, fucking Sennheiser PC-151s. How the hell do I spell that? Sennheiser PC-151. Google it. You'll, you'll find them. Oh. So. You just, you say it weird. Oh, I don't... I like over the ear, not on the ear. Oh, okay. Well, I mean, I mean, over the ear, you're always gonna get fucking warm. My, I had Turtle Beach X12s that I really liked. I really liked the ear pad design. Okay. Well, I can tell you right now, just wearing these headphones, they heat up my fucking skull. Like, I don't. I'm not a fan of this. I wish I had better ventilation. Like, I need fans, like literally, just blowing on me or something. Because this is not comfortable. I, I took the I took took the hoodie off and I'm still fucking hot, dude. You know, it's all it's all about the fucking Sennheisers, man. The way it's gotta be, dude. Although those ATX headphones are really good. Fucking ones with those again. Uh, Audio Technica. They have the best gaming headphones. What oh, gaming headphones? I already have a microphone. I just need a decent pair of headphones. There, man. Those are 80 bucks and they're like considered the best on the fucking market for the money. They literally have, like, the best reviews out of all fucking headphones. <sighs> for people who are gamers. Not for, uh, you know, because they have a lot of bass in them. Uh, so the audiophiles don't like them because they're too bass heavy. But, like, my headphones are very bass light. And I don't like that, actually. It's difficult for me to, like, I can't listen to, like, drum and bass and shit in these headphones. You know, and I'm a big fucking techno head, so it bothers me when I can't turn up the fucking bass, because that's how they're meant to be. That's how the songs are meant to be played, man. Yeah, true. Sure. No? Portable headphone amplifier, what the fuck? Besides, these have that cool fucking... A dark green color that I really like. I nearly bought those, but they're a hundred and they're nearly two hundred bucks. I actually wish I'd bought that pair of headphones over this pair of headphones. If I have it to do over again, I'll buy the Audio Technicas next time. You said these were eighty dollars. These are a hundred and fifty. They were eighty dollars. Let me click the link. Oh god. I think the lowest I see them for is 108, 118. Yeah, for the used. Uh, sorry, you want the M40s, not the M50s. There we go. There, there's the link for the M40s.
Okay, so I see a lot of links for this, but I don't actually see the actual program called MV Control. Alright, gonna buy these. On, it's on the. You know what the best part about getting things shipped from Amazon is? What's that? I have a distribution center literally two miles down the road. So the day that it says I'm going to get it, unless the person delivering my items got into a wreck, that's the day that I get it. I'm really considering getting some drumsticks now. You know what the worst thing about growing up and not being able to have whatever I wanted was? Uh, not being able to have everything you wanted, I suspect. Buying everything I ever want because I have the money. <laughs> I just bought a tablet and fucking headphones because I can. It's just frustrating, dude. Like, I feel bad for doing this. Is, is what worship? I can't read that word. Hold on. To move it to my other screen. Is ball? What the ball worship? I wish my girlfriend would worship my balls. Shit. Oh, uh, are All you right. a Jew? Whoa, whoa. Ease off on that. I'm not saying that in any kind of, you know, bad thing, but... I'm... I googled ball worship. Oh. It's a false god. It doesn't open on Windows 10. What doesn't open a window stand? Well, I double clicked the program and it does nothing. Like, I'm literally just double clicking the program and it doesn't open. As far as I can tell. I figured out today I don't, know, I don't know how to spell believe. This sounds absolutely perfect for me. I just can't fucking run it. I guess we'll try compatibility mode, I guess. Doesn't open. Application does nothing. So I'll just show you main monitor here. So here's the application. Double click it, nothing happens. It just quick circle and then goes away. It, it looks like it would do everything I fucking want, which is the worst part. Um, so I'm really fucking pissed off it doesn't work. Problem is, it hasn't been updated in a year now. Added a volume normalization option. That's fucking perfect, man. Anything over the tray? No, there's nothing over the tray for it. Look, man, I even opened Task Manager just to be sure that it wasn't running in the background somewhere and I couldn't fucking see it. You know? So. It's nowhere.
Google Chrome and it's 47 processes. Yeah, exactly right. I'm going to double click it and just watch this just to see if something moves. Nothing moves. It doesn't even, as far as I can tell, it doesn't do jack shit. My background processes goes up to 57 and then back down to 55 like instantly. Try going down here. I don't see anything fucking move. Run as administrator, Charles says. Well, it took a little slower to close there. Hold on here. Uh, you know what? I've still got compatibility assistant running, so let's just turn off compatibility for a second. Now let's try run as administrator. The fuck does run with Japanese local mean? If you want to play the really dirty hentai games, you have to fucking run in Japanese locale. <laughs> none of those none of those fucking Japanese rape games ever get over to America like you want them to yeah that's terrible Benson let's drop the subject you're talking about bud cause now you're just speculating and trying to push your beliefs onto the entire stream and I don't approve The fuck if you is want to be a runtime broker. Uh, I have it on mine too. I've heard of it, so it's probably not a virus. Cortana, go the fuck away. I don't ever want you <laughs> running on my shit ever. Hey, Cortana. Why is Worm a fucking bitch? No, I don't. I don't have it turned on. That's the oh, that's the shitty part. Is like, it's not actually on, right? So if you go to settings, it's all set fucking off. But Cortana still runs in the fucking background. If you, Did you do Cortana, your updates? if you want Cortana to go away, you actually have to physically fucking disable it. Like, literally rip the microphone off? <laughs> hey man, who handles your runtime? You brokers that shit. I really need to go through my system and clean up a lot of these fucking processes, to be honest. But, yeah, so MV control doesn't function. Which is too damn bad because it looked very promising. You guys are charging it faster and faster, but... Um... I'm gonna go through all... Uh, no, I'm not. Excuse me. <laughs> You're like, Ugh! That one snuck up on me. I, I figured, man. You got like halfway through it and you didn't. <clears throat> I think I'm gonna go ahead and head out, though, man. Alright, man. Hey Cortana Bitch It automatically listens for when I say Hey Cortana My phone does it with OK Google as well <laughs> Did you hear it? Yeah There is a Windows 7 version 
Um, called Volume Control Made Natural. I don't know if it's going to work, though. You can try it's... having Dev run it, or I don't know if you have shit. But yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna go. I'm gonna leave your stream up though. Alright man dude. Pause Spotify. Last update July two thousand nine. No thank you. Uh <laughs> Stream, have fun charging the OEP. I will. I'll, I'll thoroughly fucking enjoy myself, dude. OPP key. Just let me know what I, I did. Hula. I did try running it in co compatibility mode. Compatibility mode never fucking works. No. Um, it's compatibility mode, as far as I'm concerned, is roughly the same as uh, Windows Troubleshooter. Would, <laughs> did it work? No. Ask a friend. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> All right, dude. Peace out, man. I'll be right back, guys. <laughs> Grab a beer. Why isn't that fucking chair stream bullshit? Alright. No, I didn't want to pick up the coal. I don't care about the goddamn coal. Get out of my inventory. Okay, so I'm assuming Charles just picked up all the coal. We don't have any fucking nickel, so we can't make the iron to continue. <laughs> it's not what I'm. It's not what I'm saying. It's not what I'm saying, Vincent. Calm down. Calm. Down. <laughs> Chill out, man. Chill out. It's fine. Okay, he's almost got the next two up. We're almost to forty percent here. Um, let's take a look at how the fuel is coming, because I know we turned the fuel lines back on. They look pretty good. 
Looks like everything's moving along. Um, yeah, I don't, I don't see a reason why not. Just fucking grab the gold turbine. I don't even know where this one's fucking going. Oh, that's going over to the... We don't need that. I'm gonna stay away from him. That way I don't accidentally pick up things. Uh, we need a laser for that one. I don't think I have the nickel to make a laser for it. But I have two Mark IIs and I have... <clears throat> so what I'll do is I'll stick two Mark IIs here. And then I'll put a lens in each one of them. And if, if I have to use, like, fucking 10 Mark IIs, I'll do that. You know, uh, we're gonna need more than that. Okay. That'll, that'll do. Actually, that one's too tall, isn't it? No, those those won't work. Those won't. They, they won't. Um, so. What are we what are we talking? We got fifty I need to I need to check the trend the output of all of these. Fifty, sixty I don't th I don't think that's enough to handle one that's enough to handle one turbine, but sure as shit not two. So let's see if we have some more of the high level lenses. Um have it. I just don't, I don't have it. I'm going to turn this one back on itself so it just keeps its fuel for a little bit. I want it to be fully powered. That way we make fuel at top speed. Right. Because once we have enough fuel, let's just say we get to about 70%, we can take down those two turbines 
and bring them over here, or we can pump the energy over. It doesn't even matter because I mean we should at that point hopefully have enough fuel that all these lines will start to back up. Uh, actually, that one's completely drained. How's this one doing? Need to check on this guy in here. Okay, he's got 28 in there. So it's not terrible, but it's not great either. Um, so we are going to need to keep pumping fuel. I'm making pellets as fast as I can, man. Right, let's crack a beer. Let's get, let's get slithering. Slithering in here. It's like shitty and slithering together. I oh, don't think like that. Damn it to hell, don't go by the book. Think like a pirate. I want a man with a tattoo on his dick. Have I got the right man? Quite a strange coincidence you do, sir. Emperor! We come for you! Battle. That is a lot of fucking turbines. Dude, I wonder how much we're lagging out the fucking server with all this crap going on. That's actually not bad. 81%, that's fine. Well, look who drops in for the battle. Alicia Love coming back around. <laughs> it's pretty funny, Hula. <laughs> I'm imagining that hula the fucking cat being suplex nice okay now we can shut off the pellets shut off the pellets completely we don't need that we don't need that we don't need that we don't need that right unless we want to use this one for fuel also which Probably not necessary, because this thing keeps up pretty good. Let's see if this overfills. If this overfills, we'll, ho we'll hook up the second vat. And we'll make fuel out of that one, too. We'll just pump it up and over and right into the fucking line. Yeah, you gotta soak them in water. You actually have to remove the heat sinks and soak them in water if you want them, like, super clean. Like, here's an example. I just finished cleaning this one 
uh, about a week ago. I don't know if you can see in there. Hold on. See if I can get a good angle for the heat sinks. Uh, no, probably not enough light. I'm trying, to, trying to see if I can get a good image of how clean that basket is. I mean, that thing is like sparkling. You can you can see all the way through this thing from one end to the other. I actually did a YouTube video on it. I haven't uploaded it. It's just sitting in pieces. It needs to be edited and stitched together. And then when it's all edited and stitched together, then I'll uh, I'll upload it. Uh, GTX 560 Ti. I've got three of them sitting under my desk. I'm going to be eBaying them pretty soon. Uh, let's see here. So we want to go this way, I think. And how are we going to get over to the fuel line from here? <clears throat> I think that actually puts me straight into the fucking fuel line. Wow, that's pretty epically fucking amazing and awesome. So that's going to take... Oh, no, 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 no. Too close, too close, too close. If I want that, I have to remove that guy. Um, so the question is, do I want to take that hopper out of there completely? It is kind of a pain in the dick, so let's just, just get rid of it. Um... <clears throat> Is this this will be better and then we can double up our fuel production or that's that's the theory anyways yeah that's it's just an old card that has been sitting around um, I'm gonna I'm gonna sell it off along with its uh, brother uh, which are they've been sitting here for uh, a little while too, a while too long in my opinion um, there we go Okay, so now we'll be we'll be running double the production. I don't I don't anticipate like hold on, I need to first off change that to fuel. And no, you need to be broken. I can't have you running around with your plastic pelletness all over the fucking place. It's not gonna work. Ooh, very nice. 970 is a great card. I'm running a 960 right now. I'm contemplating whether I'm going to get another one or if I'm just going to leave it until the next gen cards come out because it's not long until the next gen cards come out and all the prices on all the cards are going to drop over the next three months. But it could be as late as midsummer. What? Oh, that's right. You are absolutely correct about that, sir. Um, well, I don't have any blocks to actually fucking move this stuff over with, so I'm gonna have to, like, be kind of stupid here. First, so first off, let's, let's just put that to remove only and just throw some canisters in it. Why? Fuck. That's coming up too close. Can't do that. I can't bring it up there. That's a big negative. That's all a big fail. It's gonna pull out of there like that. And I can't have that. Can't have it. Can't have it at all. I'm trying to think, because even if I'm there... That'll still pull out of that, won't, won't it? So I'm gonna have to step out one space to do this. Which is kind of fucking stupid, but... 
It's got to be done. It's got to be done, right? Give me some of this. I need I need some of these blocks. I'm taking some of these. Let's just come across, like, okay, so Charles is already working on that, so we're good to go. He, he, he knows what he's doing. I know what I'm doing. We, we know how this is working, so we're all good. No guarantees if I know what I'm doing, though. <laughs> uh, we just, you know, it's hope and pray. Hope and pray, right? Nope, not, not like that. Go up one more, and then turn that way, and then you turn that way, and then you go that way. Okay, and that should bring our fuel canisters up for us now. Alright. And the biomass in this side is going to be slow as fuck, but whatever. I mean, as long as they're both producing, who cares? Right? That's all that matters. Both producing fuel, both putting out fuel... transport pipes. I guess that's one way to do it. That will be certainly effective, that's for sure. Oh shit, this top one turned off, didn't it? Yeah, it's out of fuel, so that needs to... we need to shut that for a minute. And then once this guy fills up, he'll turn back on, he'll power all that shit back up, and then we'll be back off to the races here in just a second. Just just take a second. Nine seventy is a fantastic card for the money. I nearly bought it over the 960, um, but just based on what I was doing, I didn't really need it. And $200 for a card when you don't have any money is quite a bit. So it can be difficult to just go, yeah, you know what, absolutely, I can, I can afford that, I can do whatever the fuck I want. No, no I can't. both working. But one is clearly being primary and one is clearly being secondary. Still not sure how this one's getting its power. I think it's getting its power from underneath all this, but it doesn't really matter. And that should run for a while and still produce fuel, so... We're at 43%. Uh, we have four big ass sets of six turbines each. Let's do the math real quick, okay? So we're talking 24 turbines. Uh, they produce roughly 100 and let's let's get the exact number here. They do 182.29 each, right? Uh, 182? Yeah, 182. So we're producing a total of 4,374.96 power per second, right? Well, that's a that's shitty, Hova. I'm sorry. Okay, so now time for the big math. Uh, 
380 minutes, 6.3 hours of charge time from zero to full. Okay. So six hours of charge time from zero, zero to full. We're 43% done. So that gives us... Actually, let me redo that. Let me redo that. Um, we've only got about 56 million to go. So we got 56 million left. According to Charles. Yeah, I got about 3.5 hours for me. How many solars can I make right now? About five until I run out of lithium. Let's go get a bunch more lithium. Like, for instance, we've got, like, a shit ton of Mark V batteries over here. Not even using any of these, because these are not helping sustain power. They're doing absolutely fucking nothing. So we're just going to take all these down that we don't need. Okay. So now we're going to start ringing this bitch in batteries. Start throwing up the fucking solars. There we go. There's a bunch of solars. I don't know how good this is going to be, or if it's even worth my fucking time, but I've got them, so I might as well use them, right? Yo, what's up, Blights? How you been, man? looking for any kind of energy transmission blocks or anything spare that we can use at this point. Okay. That's all good. So they'll make about 20 extra power per second each. So in total, we're talking...
You are absolutely right there. What happens when it's fully charged? Basically, game one. Uh, yes to anime. I'm not entirely sure. Uh, I've never actually charged this fucker all the way, so... Just... <laughs> fucking... Whatever, dude. It doesn't... It doesn't matter. So what am I out of right now? Am I out of lithium? I'm out of lithium. And we can't do any of those. I mean, the only next thing we could do is make a whole bunch of fucking pods, but we've torn down all the pod machines, so we're not gonna go for the Mark V solar stuff, which I don't think we can anyway. I'm pretty sure it requires organics, so. Ugh, you're driving my OCD crazy, Charles. I'm moving it. I'm moving it. I'm doing it. I don't even care. It's not going to hurt anything, man. It's just going to charge that, and the OET is going to take that charge. Oh, you just moved them. I don't, I don't think it's worth it, Charles. I don't think it's worth it. Um... Nice nightlight. It's one hell of a nightlight, I'll give you that, man. Oh, you know what? That's true, Protoss. Yeah, I don't think that's going to matter, dude, because we can't afford to make the Mark IV battery anyway, and that's... Wait a minute, I thought you could put the solar panels... No, you're right, you have to put them on top of the Mark IV. Okay, so, the, yeah, the Mark III solar panels aren't going to help us at all. Complete waste of time, don't even worry about it. It will get us nothing. What we need to do is spend is every little bit of lithium we have right now and get more just regular fucking solar panels. Worst comes to worst, dude, I've got a fucking hundred PDGs on me. Oh, uh, that's, that's actually not gonna help us like one bit, dude. Uh, the lithium fucking fusion drill is without its cutter head that it requires to make proper amounts of power, so we gotta get some of those. All right. How you been today, Cellfire? Ah, oh, son of a bitch. I took my eyes off the screen for a second so I could look at chat, and I looked back and I got fucking bottlenecked. Lol. Rip. Fucking just completely jacked. Ow. I was about to say, that's gonna, that's gonna hurt. It's not gonna be a polite fall. What's this running? Eh, I could do this better uh, with just a couple more transport pipes, but I think this is probably okay. Probably gonna stay fairly well. Yeah, it's okay. It's not great, but I mean, it's not terrible. Let's wait and see what happens when it ticks over to its next um, section. Yo, what's up, Bad Rock? How you doing, man? I think the problem is actually the drill head we have in it is just a regular fusion drill head. 
I know I've got an antimatter back at the base, so let's just go grab that and change it. Where is that bitch? Now you're fucking in here somewhere. Unless I used them all. I may have used it. I guess I used it. Alright, well. Let's see if we can make one. That's a stretch. Yeah. Yeah, we need the we need nickel for that. So we're just gonna have to let it run as is for right now. Hmm. Hmm. Charles, do you have enough to make an antimatter drill motor? There's the laser drill motor in the chest, um, but the lithium line could use the antimatter drill motor on it. So if you have enough, please make that. That way we can make some more solars, because we're out of lithium. Yeah, how you been, man? So sleepy and out of energy. Well, Selfire, if you're sleepy and out of energy, go to fucking bed. It's usually what people do when they're tired. Just saying. Just saying. Usually what people do. Okay. Oh. It's a good amount of solars. We get about six minutes until the sun comes up. And those solars start making any kind of energy, so. We're just gonna have to drop down the big hole again. Get it down here to the bottom. Only 24 fucking nickel, huh? What the fuck is going on here? Why are we making so little nickel? Should be making more than that. Is the plasma head out? Plasma head's out, that's why. I didn't come down here and store enough of them. So, don't have enough nickel to make... Mm. I'm not sure if I should congratulate you about that or be concerned about you. How much ore does an OE make with plasma and antimatter fuel? Makes about 148 cell fire. About 148 ore a minute. My guess would be both bedrock and the fact that you're in Harvard doing all that. What'd you do today, Diamond Wolf? Uh, he, he did. I was politely ignoring it because he said he goes to Harvard and he smokes weed and he's a liberal. So, I, the moment, the moment he said YOLO, I knew not to take him seriously anymore. Is it the day before your birthday? Or is it your birthday? Happy birthday, Diamond Wolf.
Okay, now we can cover this fucker up. There we go. <laughs> Hot. I love that. <laughs> you didn't you didn't even spell Illuminati correctly, bad rock. He's, he's <laughs> That's pretty fucked up. Did I get enough nickel to actually make that antimatter drill head? I wonder. check. I don't actually know exactly how much it takes, so... Nope, I'm about 30... Eh, 28 bars short. So... Got plenty of everything else, just don't have the nickel. But that's okay. I mean, literally... Oh, did he leave nickel in the chest? I didn't, I didn't notice that. Um... Oh. Nice. Okay. Oh, and he, he gave me his lithium, too. Fucking excellent. Alright. So, we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna pump up the... Oh, there's a bunch of ores in here, too. You could probably smelt those and get a little bit extra. Where is the laser drill? I know there was a laser drill in this bitch. There it is. There we go. Okay, so the next thing we're gonna need is we're gonna need we're gonna need more transport pipes because we're gonna we're gonna increase the ore production down there pretty fucking heavily. I'm going to I'm going to move the old stuff. I'm saying that I'm going to I'm going to do a lot of di different things. What the fuck? These only do 5 power per second? <sighs> You're shitting me. You're shitting me. I could have sworn these fuckers did like 20. Is that the organics that do 20? That's fucking worthless. So, how many of these did we fucking make? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. So that's another 65 power per second. 20 is uneasy, that explains that. Yeah. Because the last game mode that I played was easy, so... Fuck. It's not one thing, it's something else. You know, this is actually got a Force Induction Mark II on it, doesn't it? I wonder if it keeps up. And this thing's gonna fill up really quick now. Uh, this is gonna have to be increased, though. fucking one pipe short of running it the way I want to. Let's just take that one out. We don't need that one. There we go. Yeah, that's gonna fly out of there. 
That bitch should get fucking filled up real quick now. Hundred and sixty-eight or a minute, I'm sorry, one sixty-eight, not one forty-eight. Okay, and this is actually keeping up, so we're all good. This upper side's actually a little slow, but it seems to do fine, so by the way, that hopper is not necessary. So five power per second. Uh well. That's pretty much a big waste of fucking resources, in my opinion. Unless we decide to go for uh, enriched coal and PTGs, you know. Which, what a waste of fucking time that is. So, I guess our only real option now is just to wait out the three-hour mark. I mean, it's not that big a deal to wait out the three-hour mark. It's just kind of fucking boring, in my opinion. I mean, especially with all these turbines running. Holy shit, this thing charges slow as dick. I already have so many fucking turbines on cell fire. Yo, what's up, Buster B? How you been, man? Uh, no, no, I uh, I didn't get fat. I was uh, I was fat last time. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I think you were paying attention. How you been, man? Everything I know is calibrated for noob mode. Pretty pretty much, Icarus. Pretty much. Oh, well, dude, I went from fucking noob mode to this, you know? It's like... Jetpack? Jet, jetpack? There we go. Holy crap. That took forever to turn on. How's our fuel going? Well, oh, the split seems to be fairly even. I'm a little concerned that I'm not getting enough fuel on the back end, though. What a Star Trek wet dream is this? Kinda is a Star Trek wet dream, isn't it? But it's a lot of fun, man. Uh. I 
think you mean this one here. You construct a weapon. Look around you. Can you form some sort of rudimentary lathe? <laughs> Fifty percent. It's checking the power. All good there. Running a little low there. Wonder why that is. Oh, it's probably because I. Ugh. Ugh. Why are you guys not fucking turning on? Uh, because those are all fucking full. It's just the ones on the end that are empty. This is such an inefficient fucking design. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, you know what? I'm gonna redo this design. I don't like this design. I have a better idea for this design, and I'm gonna do it. Charles, are you picking up all my shit? He probably is. Now mind you, I've never actually built this design, so I have no idea if it's going to work or how it's going to work. So I'm just fucking around for right now, I guess. I want to do it too high or one high. I probably want to do it too high, just to make it easier for myself to put it together. But that's going to leave the actual blocks up too tall. I can laser transmitter straight in the side of the vat, can't I? I'm pretty sure I can. Should be okay. So, here's what I'm going to attempt to do. I'm going to attempt to make this design more effective. Uh, I'll have less sides to place PTGs, and it'll take a lot more hoppers. So my surface area is going to be reduced considerably here, um, but I think I'm okay with that. I just have to figure out where I want the hoppers, to be honest. That's going to be the tough part. I've never tried this design, I'm just, so I'm, I'm basically just fucking around, but who cares at this point, right? So, let's think of how the turbines are going to go. So that's going to be that pair, that's going to be that pair, that's going to be... See, those are both powered, those are both powered, those are not, so those will need individual power. And so will these two here. And then the top two. And then the side two over here. Like that. But this should allow for better transfer from the power block to the laser. Um which I actually need one more power block to put the laser on. Uh, yeah, so we gotta make at least one more power block, I figure. So 
so something like that. And we're just going to fill this up with coal on top of the everything that was there. Oh, that'll work. And these aren't, don't have a very high transfer rate because these aren't going to be powered very well anyway. So I think two Mark II lasers probably should drain this whole thing for power. So that should be fine. But I think we had like 12 PTGs on it. And I think only like four were actually running. Uh, so this should at least increase it by an additional... Um, Actually, how many do I have on a side? We got eight on eight on eight on a side, so we're talking. I should get another twelve PTGs actually powering this. Okay, now here's the question: Does that work? Is that actually providing power for it? It looks like it is. Okay, it's not great, but it's doing a job. You know. I don't know why I've never thought of this design before. It's actually fairly effective. Alright, Benson, you have a good one, man. Welcome back, Bedrock. Uh, yeah, 100 million, Trank. 100 million. Bad Rock Gaming, be pot-smoking Harvard liberal. Spends his late night watching Mr. Worm play Fortress Craft. Actually, finish playing Fortress Craft. This is the end of the game, once that motherfucker is charged up. I'm very curious to see what happens when it's charged. Making fuel at an okay rate. And I say okay rate is in it's really not great. Ooh, that actually helped. Nice. I don't know how long it'll help for until all the batteries are fucking drained, but for right now, it seems to have done something. So, I'll take it. And then we're just gonna throw a bit of enriched coal in the side of this bitch. And that should share between all four eventually at some point. Yo, what's up, bad boy? How you doing, buddy? So we've turned off all the additional lines at this point. The only thing we're doing is just sending all the power straight to the OET from every single angle that we can possibly get our hands on. Um, the next thing I need to do is I need to go check and see if I have any more lithium, if the nickel has charged back up, and if we can get some, I don't know, I mean I, I think adding solars is fucking stupid at 5 power per second personally. I think it'd be considerably more effective to save those resources, um, maybe even start making pellets again, and make some more turbines. If if this is what the next three hours is going to be like, is me just sitting here with my thumb up my butt, I might as well use it for something productive, right? Oh, that's cool, Bad Rock. Are you, uh, are you trying to show your parents that you're in a rebellious phase? Damn it, that's the second time I've done that. I keep thinking that's the deep one, the 300 meter one. 
Yeah, man. We'll have a party, dude. We'll listen to some rancid and, you know, kick it old school. Yeah, I don't know. What exactly don't you know? I recommend you start sooner rather than later, Bad Rock. Whoa, Trank. I know a lot of people that need to pick up a bong. Just saying. I've killed an entire species. Talking about Bad Rock's brain cells there. A righteous! No, that's not the one I wanted to be. I knew that. Just got turned around, that's all. Oh, there we go. Here's another one. Hey, don't open that! It's an alien planet! Is there air? You don't know! Night terrors, huh? They can be a bitch. We're gonna go grab the crystal real quick. Just in case we need it for something. So many fucking hoppers. Well, bonds aside, there's plenty of storage down here. The problem, Bad Rock, is that Goosebump characters never come to life. Not that I'm aware of. Not that I've ever seen, anyway. I mean, I'm not saying it never happens. It just it seems a little unlikely. Goosebumps movie isn't for you then. <laughs> Sounds.
sounds like you need to talk to a therapist. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. I, I would 100% recommend that you talk to a therapist. Bad rock. It never hurts anybody to talk to a therapist. Ever. take the 350 drop this time got about 100 nickel bars there just a little bit short of it it's fine it'll do about 100 titanium and of course there's no gold we unhook the gold line so there's no power to it Negative hula will not cut through a hive. Nothing will cut through a hive. Except for a bomb. Only bombs. As far as I'm aware. I wouldn't try it anyway. Potentially just, you know, what happens you just piss that hive off. All of a sudden it just takes over your whole fucking... You know, everything you got? No, no thanks. Alright, how's the fuel going? Okay, so that line looks backed up. What was that guy? Slowly backing up. That line's backed up. And what about this guy here? Uh, not even close to that one. Still need another 50 or so canisters. So, seeing as how, guys, we have roughly about another three hours before this completes. Here's what I'm going to do. Shark is currently streaming, so we're going to go ahead, Shark. All right, ladies and gentlemen, seeing as how uh, we've got about another three hours before the OET gets close to being completed, uh, I'm going to shut the stream down for a couple hours. Uh, I've got some video work I need to do uh, for the YouTube. i got to get a lot of videos uploaded and, and organized and so on and so forth, so I'm going to start doing that, and while that's going on, we're going to go do a raid real quick over to Shark, okay, CK. Um, you guys know him, you guys love him, I hope you love him, I don't know. 
to or not. I don't really care. We're still going to do the raid. So here's the way it works. Uh, I do hashtag worm raid. You guys do hashtag worm raid. Please click the first link in the description. Additionally, if you haven't checked them out, please check out both my YouTube and my Twitter. Uh, they are both going to be here in the description. We'll be back in about two and a half hours or so to finish the OET charge. For those of you that miss it, we will record the whole thing and upload it to YouTube later. And I will check you guys later. You guys be good. And for those of you who don't come back, peace out and have a good one. You had the info. Come hang out with the cool kids. Why do you teach Spanish? Uh-uh. -oh.